Hi, it's Kathy the Crafty Chica. Welcome back to my channel. And today I am reviewing the Icon Art Stencil System. I saw this at the 2019 Creativation event. That is the, like the craft industry trade show. And I loved it. I was so intrigued. So I ended up buying one because you can make your own silk screens. The first step is to come up with your designs. Now you need to print your designs onto a sheet of the printer film. Basically, this is a thick, milky transparency sheet. You want to make sure that you put this on your printer so it will print on the rough side. There's a super shiny side and a rough side. So for my printer, I had to put it face down and then I fed it through and then it came out like this. Here is my printer sheet that has my designs on there. When you get your kit, it comes with this nice little setup guide, and then it comes with a user guide. And you'll also get this in the kit, one of these clipboards. This is good for rinsing out your screens. And lastly, you will get a package of the photosensitive film. So you have to keep this sealed in the pouch. It is photosensitive and there's five sheets in here. So make sure when you take it out that you take out one sheet. And here's where we're going to burn our screen. This is what it comes with. It has this black mat that is really, really helpful for placing your design on top so that the light will be blocked out. And I'm taking out one of the pieces of the silk screen. Make sure the shiny side is down. Place your design on top and it comes with a clear sheet to put on top. Plug it in for 35 seconds and then you're going to remove it and it's done. The screen is burned. It doesn't look like anything right now, but trust me, the magic will happen when you start rinsing it off with the sprayer. This process takes about 10 minutes. Once you see that all your designs are nice and clear, set them out to dry. Once they're completely dry, you can leave it as is or you can cut them up into small pieces, which is what I'm doing to fit on my little dishes. When you go to use it, remove the plastic backing, but keep it nearby because you're going to need it. These have a little bit of a sticky back, which makes them nice. That way they won't move as you're adding the paint. For this specific project, I'm using underglazes mixed with some silkscreen medium to apply this to these little bisque dishes. So I'm rubbing it on with my finger, but you can also use these with craft paint or fabric paint for other types of projects. You can continue using the same silk screen to do other pieces, but after about three or four times, you wanna rinse it off in water and then you can use it again. Once you're done with that silk screen, simply apply it to the plastic backing and let it dry. Look at all these little ring dishes I made with my new silk screen. They turned out perfect. I got a clean print every time. Okay, now check out what these dishes look like out of the kiln. They've been fired. I even added designs on the backs of them because I just was having too much fun. And yeah, so I'm really happy with the Icon Art system. You could use it on so many different things. My next one, I'm going to use it on t-shirts. So stay tuned because I'll share a tutorial for that as well. Let me know in the comments what you think of this. Is this a machine that you think you would like? I know I love it. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And visit CraftyChica.com for even more craft tutorials.